Hey, so we back for another one. If you didn't catch the first one to this series of free game, pretty much we're just going to have a lot of pop-off messages, timeless energy for the month of August going to the first couple weeks of September. Your girl's going on a vacation at the end of the month. I will be closing out, shutting down my personals for a little bit. Y'all will still get content put on YouTube because I will pre-record the timeless energy. Okay. So when you get the message, when you see the message, it's when you need to hear it. All right. The general guys, if it ain't your story, check another one. Okay. Check the placement signs. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let's get to a thousand subscribers so we can go live and do some stuff. Okay. So. I'm picking up a confession coming in. Somebody can't take it anymore. Like, they, they can't anymore. They can't. They... I would die for you. Yeah. Could be going through some legal matters or just feeling like they need to make this right. Like, I just heard out of time. Okay? Somebody feel like they're running out of time. Okay? They've been watching you. They're not sure. They're just trying to see how you're moving. They want. They trying. Okay, yeah. There's a, ca a karmic masculine out here uh, that you could have ended it with. So, male or female, guys. We got masculine, and feminine in it. So, however this person is operating, there's a karmic energy, masculine type energy, who you could have ended things with, and they're watching you. Okay. This person wants to come back around, but you cannot trust them. You cannot trust them at all. Get them three to five business days. I'm telling you, they about to roll in, okay? Like a chick. <laughs> but, yeah, spirit is just like, no, that's a, that's casket right there, closed casket. And you know this too within your heart. I feel like this person tries to pull on your heartstrings, okay? They may be of West Indian descent, okay? They may have dreads. But, yeah, you're tired of being hurt by this energy. So let's see what's this message here for the collective. Spirit. Message here for the collective. For this pop off. What do we have? What's this energy here? What's this about for the collective? Please and thank you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, we'll see. Spiritual as fuck, because I think I just hit it all on the nose. May not even have to do too much clarifying. So what we got first? So initials DJ, no, DJ, right? DJ, P as in Paul, V as in Victoria. First, last, middle initial, street name as well as place of employment. You are a diva. And like I said, somebody is looking at you. You could be born in the month of April. Cancer, um, listen to me, you could be a Cancer. April, July, or August, um, the numbers four, seven, eight of significance here. However you're seeing it, could be four, 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 seven, 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 eight, eight, eight. Could be in the street address, okay? Tell your phone number could start with four, seven, eight. You could be four, seven, eight area code. But um, whoever you are, you're a diva. Like, you're confident, you, you boss status, your bag on point, you got titles, you got Ds, you got shit in your name. Your, like, your shit is in order, okay? Um, this energy, like I said, they see that time is running out here, okay? So it says, I saw the shot clock. I'm back and I'm better. Your love holds me together. I know you're sick of them, so don't go back. I'm here, okay? Like I said, you have an old karmic energy that's trying to come back around because they feel that you know, they can be better than your new person or what you're trying to move on to. Like, it really does feel like a holding back type of energy. Yeah, they're trying to cause some sort of shakeup or eruption here. Um, also, with that fire and desire, okay, that's Aries, Scorpio energy here. A lot of Mars. So, it could be some sort of conflict that this person's trying to put in your life. Also, for some, yeah, this is some conflict somebody's trying to put into your life, okay? There's that confession. They can't take it anymore. I said I felt it. So, like, they can't take it anymore. So, somebody highly, like, they truly desire you as well in this spread, okay? This is your new, this is new energy. Somebody truly desires you, but in the same breath, that shakeup is this ex trying to come back around and mess it up. 
And I don't know if like your new person is also seeing that your ex is trying to come back in and they can't take it anymore and they have to come in and let you know what's up before, I don't know, like if you just give in and start dealing back with this energy again. Yeah, you are very much so protected. So don't go back and deal with the past. But I, I'm also feeling like even if you do try to give it a chance out of the kindness of your heart, I'm hearing like you'll see that it's to go to shit instantly and you'll walk away still in your diva status. Yeah, because you'll see, like I said, that this person is bottom of the barrel regardless. Spirit said, put that there. In the next 24 hours, you could be receiving this confession here from the time that you watched this video. Yeah, because somebody has checked themselves, okay? They they realize, like, what the hell am I doing? Like, I'm about to miss out, okay? Also, for some of you guys, you might need to check your own shit, like, check your cars, Check your accounts, things of that nature, things that are, you know, near and dear because somebody might be messing with your shit. Okay, we got Georgia Atlanta here. Just peachy, though. Like I said, don't worry. Everything is still going to pan out and be fine because you're being divinely guided. Okay. And somebody is out here, like I said, trying. I, nope. In my inner thoughts. This is that karmic trying to come back and manipulate with this black magic type energy, this manipulating type energy. How you could even have somebody really trying to do this work. Like I said, everything is all good. You're being divinely guided through whatever it is you're going through right now. Okay? 444, divinely guided. That's lots of protection. Whoever's doing this type of energy, they're bottom of the barrel anyway. Okay? It, that is what that is. Let's see. Clarify some of this energy here. All right, spirit. What is this shit? Like, literally, we're not even going to clarify by cards. Who is this karmic masculine coming back around? Four cups, gratitude. Somebody who knows they missed an opportunity with you, okay? Water energy here, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Heavier on the Cancer energy, but this person knows that they messed up. They know they messed a good thing with you here. Four of Pentacles here. Capricorn energy. They know why you're holding back. They kind of wish that you don't, that you wouldn't. Okay, this could be somebody that you have a family dynamic with. I'm seeing all it. 444 four, four. again. Somebody that you realize you had to protect yourself from and get away from. And now they realize they missed an opportunity with you. Or it could even be somebody that you were trying to protect and bring with you on this journey. And a lot of you guys had to check yourself and realize, like, nope, you're bottom of the barrel. 444, four, four. I just need to let this go. Um, How does my collective see this person 808 on the clock as i ask boom nigga like they fucking very nurturing energy you could have children with this person okay yeah this person probably also juggled you possibly with another child's parent okay trying to balance things out with you giving to you and somebody else all right. It, I feel like it was definitely about making it work for the sake of some sort of parenting dynamic. Yeah, we got Virgo energy here. You feel like you need, you did feel like you needed to ghost this person. Like you you understood something. It could have been in the way that you communicated with this person. Yeah, Six of Swords energy here. Aquarius, he started to look at things from a bigger picture, and you realized that you had to move away. They were trying to kill you. Like did they? Because you're a unicorn, you're you're a magical, you're a diva. You got to go on and you realize that they were trying to like put you in a cage or even take your power, okay? Stop you from being grounded, stop you from getting to the bag, stop you from just having your stuff in order, okay? Tell me about this new energy because there's definite new energy here that's confessing. I also feel like this is that past energy also trying to come in with some confession, but you already know what they're about. I feel like you got new energy trying to come in and make a confession here. So what's up with this new energy trying to come in for the collective? What's this fire and desire? That feels like new energy. Yeah, I feel like you already know who this person is or it could be um a Pisces. Could be Cancer Scorpio. I mean, High Priestess is intuitive energy. But it... Mm, 
This is somebody that you, you're familiar with. You don't know everything about this person, especially with this Eight of Cups here. You could have emotionally walked away from this person or you may have felt like this person has. But for some reason, I want to feel like... Yeah, intuitively, this is somebody that you could have emotionally disconnected yourself from. Okay. Also feel like you know that this person is walking away from some sort of challenges here. With these two mountains. You guys could be at a distance from each other. Like on the other side of the world. Like when I'm looking at these mountains. Heavy Pisces energy, especially with the Eight of Cups. King of Swords, yeah, this is somebody that you may not even talk to like that, okay? Communication may not be there. In Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But like I said, this is somebody who knows that they need to come in because this person may also feel like you're emotionally detached from them and that you're walking away, okay? Like I said, because they, they're also seeing the shot clock and they feel like they need to come in and say something. Yeah, they know that they need to start, they need to come in and take action with this Ace of Wands, Two of Swords. It's time for them to come clean, come in and speak their truth. Yep. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Because you're the diva. You're a boss. Virgo. That's what I'm picking up. Beyonce. I'm a diva. I'm a boss. I pull up at my two-seater. All that. Whatever. <laughs> I'm a savage. Okay. They think you're a savage. <laughs> they are afraid that you might cuss them out or rip their head off. But you're really just focused on your money right now. You are very you're being you're very passionate about your money right now, okay? Fixed on it, Taurus type energy, but working very hard, giving, you know, doing what you gotta do, seeing things from both sides and knowing how to get to it. Capricorn energy. Very determined focused, like hard working. You're hard working. Okay. I had to ask about that bottom of the barrel. Yeah, like I said, that's that karmic ex, the one who likes to lie and all that. The person who's now seeing you in the spotlight, the snake who's trying to pull you back in as you're grounding yourself out and you're getting your shit together. The liar, the big ass fucking liar, yeah, th that you were in a relationship with, who wants to still come back around and like, lie. Tell me about this, um, black mat. Thank you. Yeah, the lies and deception, manipulating, okay? Seven of Swords energy on this. Somebody who just wants to come back around and play more games and hurt you and lie to you, manipulate you, try to lower you, okay? Make you feel insecure, okay? Take you off of the pedestal that you put on yourself, okay? Yeah, somebody from your past, okay? Scorpio energy. Aquarius energy with the Seven of Swords. Like I said, you also have children with this person, because I said that, you know, they were juggling, you know, could have been juggling you and another child's parent or something like that, or just juggling you, period, you know, while you were busy trying to love them and you realized you had to ghost this individual. Okay, yeah, it's, they do a lot of moon magic, a lot of shit behind the scenes that you don't know about, a lot of shit, trying to end you, lay you to rest, fuck up your clarity, your mind space so that you can't move forward, trying to put you in depression, okay, have you confused, But like the cards say, this is supposed to happen, okay? This person's going to be at a loss. Everything is going to be all good. They're digging their own grave. This king of pentacles, maybe this is somebody that you were connected to, married to, okay? Somebody you could work with, a boss. They're digging their own grave, whoever's trying to sabotage you. And then the same breath, you got somebody who's trying to come in and make things right with you. Who's afraid. And this is all because of how you're moving here. You're in like this queen of disc energy, this queen of pentacles energy. And diva is fuck. Looking good too. Diva is fuck. Not taking no nobody's foolishness. Yeah, you're not. King of Wands, the sun, and the teacher, aka the hierophant. 
So yeah, you definitely got a masculine energy out here or like your drive and ambition is really like making somebody like somebody's taking notes like crazy. This even is the universe. This is God, you know, checking it, doing the um he's making that list and he's checking it twice. He's doing that Santa work too, feel me? And I feel like them blessings is coming, okay? Like everything is starting to become illuminated, you know, everything that you could have thought of that you wanted to achieve, that you manifested, that you were praying for, yeah, that you were writing down, you know, in your your petitions, your manifestations, your prayers, they were heard, you know, like it's coming out now and they're moving towards you, okay? We got Leo energy out here on that King of Wands, all right? Yeah, the star, man, I'm telling you, this, I was looking at this, this is what I was drawn on, the star, okay? The sun is a star, okay? Like... And that's what I was looking at. Like everything that you could have wanted is now coming. You're being blessed. It's coming towards you. It's coming in for you. That's why everything is all good. Keep making them moves. Keep doing what you got to do. Be fierce within yourself. That diva energy. Okay. Yeah. Because this is where we're going. Ten of Pentacles. That's what we're closing at. Ten of Pentacles. Keep putting in that work. Okay. Keep putting in that work. Final message here. Okay, yeah, get that shit up. There's better shit on the horizon. We're not dealing with the past. Guess I'll just chill. Yes, you will. Sit down and shut up and keep your head down and focus on what you're doing because you want to come up, bitch, sir. <laughs> All right, so that has been this pop-off message. Again, general, timeless. When you see is when you see it. All right, guys, so until the next time we speak, peace out.